It started in 1976 with a young preacher from Mississippi. We sat down to watch television as a family one night, and uh, we had some pretty hard profanity on. I'd seen a deterioration in television programming in the last several years. Grieved by what he saw on TV, Reverend Don Wildman started Turn Your TV Off Week at his church. Well, the news got out, and soon it went national. We at CBSC and Mr. Wildman's coalition, perhaps the greatest assault on intellectual freedom that we have witnessed in many years. Here I am from Mississippi thinking I could influence the networks. If one program out of five is good, isn't that one? Yes, sir. No, it's terrific. Why not? No, sir. It's terrific. Five out of five ought to be good. They call me a little bunch of names. They call me Hitler. They call me McCarthy. The efforts of the coalition are only half a step removed from book burning. Gene Jankowski, president of CBS, called me the Ayatollah of the religious right. That ain't bad for a country preacher from Mississippi. <laughs> Through this movement to compel the networks to remove offensive programming, American Family Association was born. And now a new division of AFA is working to get uplifting content back on the air through movies, television programs, and documentaries. The purpose of television should be to uplift, to inspire, to encourage, to try to build a better society, not to try to tear down the one we have. Uplift, inspire, encourage. American Family Studios.